We now know the name of the Providence man who died in a motorcycle crash on I-95 in Pawtucket yesterday. 12 News reporter Lauren Brill spoke with Rhode Island State Police, joining us now from Pawtucket with more on what may have led up to that crash. State police say 37 year old Christopher Varble is the victim of last night's fatal crash. Police believe that speed and lack of a helmet are factors. The deadly motorcycle crash happened on I-95 South in Pawtucket during the Friday evening commute. Rhode Island State Police say the victim, 37-year-old Christopher Varble of Providence, was traveling in the high-speed lane of Route 95 South in Pawtucket near the Broadway overpass. He was not wearing a, uh, a helmet, and we, helmet and we believe that speed was a factor. Lieutenant David Gormley tells 12 News Varble hit a Jersey barrier and was thrown off the bike. And seen uh, one motorcycle was uh, located in the right shoulder of the roadway and the operator of that vehicle uh, was located deceased on scene uh, in the high speed medium. Our cameras captured Pawtucket police and fire investigating along with state police. Lieutenant Gormley says this is the 12th motorcycle death on Rhode Island roadways this year. And of those 12 motorcycle accidents, uh, nine of the uh, parties involved were not wearing helmets. Uh. Although Rhode Island does not require helmets, Lieutenant Gormley says the best way to bring these numbers down is not only wear a helmet, but ride at a safe speed. Police say no other vehicles were involved and they are continuing their investigation and looking to interview any other witnesses who were at the scene. Reporting in Pawtucket, Lauren Brill, 12 News.